Hello my creative friend. Today I'm going to read to you from another one of my favorite books. This one comes from Paulo Coelho as you can see and um, this is the book that he has written just before writing his most famous book and the bestseller that is Alchemist. But this book is no less important and no less brilliant than Alchemist itself. In this book, Paolo describes his own quest, the modern day quest for ancient wisdom. He describes the simplicity of life's most profound truths in this book. This is the book that I cherish so very much and I do hope that it will spark something glorious inside you today. Once a poet said that no man is an island. We need friends and when the friends aren't nearby we have to turn solitude into our main weapon. We need the help of everything around us in order to take the necessary steps towards our goal. Everything has to be a personal manifestation of our will to win the good fight. If we don't understand that, then we don't recognize that we need everything and everybody and we become arrogant warriors and our arrogance will defeat us in the end because we will be so sure of ourselves that we won't see the pitfalls there on the field of battle so the only way to deal with our messenger is to accept him as a friend by listening to his advice and asking for his help when necessary, but never allowing him to dictate the rules of the game. Like you did with the boy, to keep the messenger from dictating the rules of the game, it is necessary first that you know what you want and then that you know his face and his name. How can I know them? I asked. And then Petrus taught me the messenger ritual. Wait until night to perform it when it is easier, Petrus said. Today, at your first meeting, he will tell you his name. This name is secret and should never be told to anyone, not even me. Whoever knows the name of your messenger can destroy you. Petrus got up and we began to walk. Shortly, we reached the field where the farmers were working. We said buenos dias to them and went on down the road. If I had to use a metaphor, I would say that your angel is your armor and your messenger is your sword. Armor protects you under any set of circumstances, but a sword can fall to the ground in the midst of a battle, or it can kill a friend, or be turned against its owner. A sword can be used for almost anything, except as something to sit on, he said, laughing. <laughs>